Um, my name's Mary Keller. I live in Glacier View Meadows. I have one child that attends Red Feather Lakes Elementary, and presently I'm secretary of the PTO. Overall, how do you feel about the process? Um, I'm impressed that it works. Um, when we started this process, we had found documentation that it was already closed. Our school was already closed, and they, they referred to it in places as a past tense. So I am amazed that it worked. Um, so I'm pleased with the outcome because we kept hearing from sources, no, you're not going to make it, you're not going to make it. But then you saw the commitment of our community and the fact that they went to every one of those meetings and members were listening. Uh, board members were listening. Do you think there was one overriding factor? I do. What do you think that was? Um, there was money found, um, state money that it is attached to rural schools. And this money is to keep rural schools alive. Um, we have been getting that money. There are eight schools, I believe, in all of Poudre School in the state of Colorado. Okay. Red Feather Lakes is the only one in Poudre School District that gets that money. Uh, they thought when that school closed down that that money would stay for the mountain schools. It would not. And it was verified that this year they would have lost $76,000. Last year we got um, $86,000. Uh, that has always been deposited in the general fund. And so, so from that perspective, do you think that Red Feather Elementary is still in jeopardy? Yes. Okay. Financially, we are. Financially. What do you think that people in the community can do in order to, you know, make sure that as we move forward that the school doesn't find itself in the same situation? Advertise our school. Push our school. We start um, doing things like we're going to try and publish a big ad in the newspapers, Red Feather's here and we're open, and invite people, push what we do have, push that we have a homework hotel, push that we're in the process of doing an environmental learning center. Uh, Fox Acres is going to open up tennis lessons to Red Feather students only. Just push our school.